Hey guys, so do you have a dog, a golden retriever, a poodle, great den, or the tiny chihuahua? There are over 170 recognized dog breeds. So this diversity in the dog breed is only possible because of the interbreeding between the breeds. So dog as a whole species have descended from wolves or an ancestor before wolves. So now guys, let me tell you a story. The story how we turn wolves into dogs. So the process behind this is called artificial selection. It's evolution which is caused because of human influence. So we come back to the story. So back then when we humans were hunters and gatherers, we used to go to other places to find food. So these wolves used to find it convenient to get the food that we left over. So generation by generation these wolves and their young ones adapted themselves to be around humans. So the less vigorous wolves were domesticated by humans because they helped them in hunting. So this domestication of wolves generation by generation turned wolves into a dog. So if you don't believe me, let me tell you about an experiment conducted on the silver foxes. So the experiment began in the 19th century. A team spent years breeding silver foxes. Silver foxes are cousins of wolves. They selected the foxes that showed least fear to humans. After about 10 generations of control breeding, domesticated silver foxes no longer showed any fear to humans. They even wagged their tails and licked their human caretaker to show affection. They also started to have spotted coats, floppy ears and curled tails. So on the Christmas day, that is the 25th, uh, we are planning a Q&A session. So if you have any questions, you can write us in the comments below. You can even write us on the social networking links, which are here. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, give us a thumbs up. Share the video with your friends. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't. And as always, stay curious, stay awesome.